What is up you guys? It's Mackenzie and I guess I should go back to the old intro since I'm no longer going to be a college student after today. So, welcome back to my channel or nice to meet you if you're new. Before we get into today's day in the life vlog, make sure you subscribe down below and hit the bell so you don't miss any videos I post. So today is officially my last day of college classes. Eh. Ever. And like saying that gives me a little emotional. Ah! I told myself I wasn't gonna cry today. So um, it is about 8:50 now. I'm going to head to campus. I have two classes today. Um, <laughs> Nonverbal communication and um, uh, social issues and humanities. So. That is what we are doing. I have my energy and it is so very on brand of me to wake up late and not look cute for my last day of classes. Um, so I just grabbed a quick little cookie dough Laura bar for my breakfast and we are literally in um, leggings and a sweatshirt. So I also wanted to quickly apologize for the last video. I'm not sure in what order I'm going to post videos, but I know whatever college days in my life of my last full week of classes was a hot mess. I apologize. Um, I was just going through so much with finals and work and everything. Um, it's not an excuse, but I'm giving one. So here we are. So yeah, let's head to campus for my last college classes ever. I should have been vlogging while I was driving by. I just had a full <laughs> mental breakdown. I was listening to sad songs about like growing up and living your life. And here we are. I called my mom and I was like bawling. And I was like, mom, I am not doing well. <laughs> I feel like this is so dramatic because it's not even graduation yet. But if you guys knew the half of what I went through, not only physically but definitely mentally to be able to be here today and say that I graduated I'm graduating like I I think I've talked about this before but like I didn't even think I was gonna make it through high school to be able to graduate from high school so to be here today at 20 years old it, it feels surreal and I think that's what I'm reflecting on is not necessarily that I'm graduating like woohoo big whoop but just how crazy it is to be here and and how much I've had to get through to be here and how much of a miracle it is that I stand here today to to say that I'm graduating does that make sense? I don't know, but we're on campus. Last time parking in garage two, baby. Let's go. There's literally no one on campus today, so I'm wondering if most professors canceled class and mine are just the annoying ones that didn't. Ryan Litz. <laughs> to feel I was like sad and then I sat in class and I was like nostalgic like I was like oh like last time walking on campus like for not graduation did I pop this I feel like that got bigger just in class um but then now I'm like numb not numb but like it doesn't feel real so now that classes are officially done and I'm on summer break, 
even though I'm gonna be on summer break for the rest of my life at this point. Um, I need a graduation dress. So instead of my graduation pictures, what I did for that, if you watch that vlog, we're actually getting it a few days in advance. So there's a Windsor like 15, 20 minutes away from the school. So I'm going to try there to see if I can find a cheap white dress. Um, since I'll definitely only be wearing this one once since it was like, since it is such like a big moment graduation you know what I mean I am here in coconut point my map says I'm at Windsor but I'm definitely not I'm at West Elm and there's like PacSun um and it's sad I've lived here for two years and come to coconut point so many times to shoot content and I still don't know where things are <laughs> I was a little shocked at how slim their white dress pickings were like short white dresses because it is graduation season and I know they cater to you know women our age so I was a little shocked about that but I found a dress that I love I'm not gonna tell you guys which one it was that I tried on you guys will see on my graduation get ready with me that I plan on filming but I also did pick up an adhesive lift bra um, because I've been needing one of these and I keep forgetting like when I go to like Target or whatever to pick one up so I saw this um, and a lot of the dresses I tried on not giving it away um, needed a backless bra anyway so it has been a long time since my boobies have been in a sticky bra because I have not been dancing or haven't had like a prom or a homecoming um, so we are going to see how this goes but I am going to head home. It is 12.23 now and your girl is starving. So I'm going to grab some lunch and then get home and figure out the rest of the day. I know this isn't like a full on college day in the life. I don't have any homework to do or anything like that. But um, yeah, this is life after college, I guess. Yeah, I just got home. I grabbed some lunch on the way home. The first thing I'm going to do is put a load of laundry in. I'm going to wash my sheets because I did not wash them Sunday, yesterday. And usually I wash my sheets um, once or twice a week. So I'm going to go ahead and put those in. that my clothes are in the washer i'm going to go ahead and finish editing this video and get it uploaded for I'm using my comforter as a pillow um but i'm so excited for this video it's the most excited i've been for a video in a long time um it's very personal very raw very real talking about the different things i learned throughout my 19th year of life um and that'll definitely be up before this one obviously so go check it out if you haven't